So if you're in any kind of emergency and you found a water source and you have the ability to at least boil it or put uh, sterilizing tablets in but you don't have a filter you could use a medium like a scarf but it's not a brilliant way to do it you're best just leaving it stand for half an hour then boil it don't worry about what color it is that's what I'm gonna leave to stand let's get close up of that gonna do nothing to it other than rest it for half an hour I'm gonna hide it here Welcome to Beck's Bug Out Survivor Quick Tips. Okay, about 25 30 minutes has elapsed before I put that water down. That is a lot clearer than it used to be. Now it's not pristine, but then again, that has all the sediment at the bottom, so it's worth just sitting your water and you're not going to get bits between your teeth if you drink this because you're going to boil it anyway it's going to be clean in that effect it's just going to be a different color once you put a tea bag in you're not going to notice so don't worry about drinking water that is brown but do worry about drinking dirty water you haven't boiled Wave beats music. now to make that safe to drink i put two Oasis tablets in that. I haven't used iodine for years and years but it is a lot clearer than it used to be. You can try running it through a scarf or a mill bank and what I'm going to do is start tipping some of this away to show you the sediment at the bottom. All this is good water, there's no bits in it, there's no sediment, no soil, no leaves all that is down the bottom here look at the color of that that is just by standing it for a half hour i had water running out of my tap at home the same color as that less cloudy water i've just shown you and uh, that was because there was some work going on on the main pipes in the street and somebody had gone through the actual main line with a digger but uh, somebody knocked at the door and said don't worry about the colour of it just boil it good advice until next time take care i'll see you out there